Ukrainian army prepares to seize Tokmak and close the land corridor from Crimea to Russia. By the new year, the Ukrainian army can take important road junctions in Tokmak and close the land corridor from Crimea to Russia. This was said by Roman Zvitan, a Ukrainian military expert. According to him, due to the rains, the front in Donbass will calm down, so the Ukrainian army will start moving in the direction of Zaporizhia. The land in this direction is not the same as in Donbass. Therefore, the Ukrainian army will be able to move comfortably in tracked vehicles even in the rainy season. Before the new year, we can see progress towards the railway to Tokmak. The line along this railway junction is Russia's main land corridor from Crimea and along this corridor, they transport equipment deep into the front. Therefore, it is extremely important to control it. Tokmak is a vital railway junction and the key to taking the city of Melitopol at the neck of the Crimean Peninsula. It is less than 20 kilometers behind the front line and surrounded by its own defensive ring. Approaches to the town are heavily fortified, the Russians proving adept at making Ukraine pay for every kilometer taken. Russian military logistics depends heavily on the rail system, but this network is under increasing attacks, not just from Ukrainian artillery, but also from precision strikes by HIMARS rocket batteries and storm shadow cruise missiles. The Russian military realizes Tokmak's importance and has heavily reinforced its units there. Ukrainian forces can choose to directly assault the town with its implication of high casualties or go around it, which would result in it being surrounded and cut off. Either way, the town's rail line would be cut.